for coming over to my house for a sleepover. This will be so cool. Yeah, of course. We're best friends. Why would I say no? Um, out of curiosity, when are we going to arrive there? It's taking a very long time. Oh, just right now. My house is right after this corner. All right, we've arrived. Whoa, this is your house? Yeah, it's pretty awesome. We just redid the wallpaper recently. Um, okay, cool. Uh, where do we park our bikes? Oh, we'll place them on the front porch. Follow me. I'll give you a tour around the house. All right, this is the living room. The TV here does not work. I, I don't know why. But I do have a TV in my room where we can play the coolest new games. But we'll do that after the tour. Follow me. And this is my favorite room, the kitchen. There's chips, sandwiches, and ice cream. Speaking of which, I'm going to grab some for myself. Want some ice cream? Uh, no, no thanks. Your loss. I'm going to grab some more before we go. You okay? You look like you just seen a ghost. Oh, hi, Uncle Bob. Oh, you did the dishes for me? Thank you. That's very sweet. Oh, him? This is my friend, Austin. And Austin, this is my uncle, Bob. All right, me and Austin are going to continue the tour around the house. See you later. The next room is the dining room. It tends to be crowded in there. I hope you don't mind. Guys, look. A visitor. Hi, Hi visitor. visitor. Austin, I'll do a quick introduction to them for you. This is my cousin, Lauren. Do you like to eat drywall, too? These are the twin cousins, Perry and Terry. Greetings, visitor. I am very grateful to meet you. And this is my sister, Susan. What's up? And everyone, this is Austin. Hi, Hi Austin. Hi, Austin. All right, everyone, we're going to continue the tour. See you later. Bye. Bye. Dude, you didn't tell me your house was on a big family? Yeah, but they're all really nice. Come on, we got a couple more rooms left. Do you get motion sick easily? Uh, I don't think so. Great, because this next hallway is a bit woozy. Just follow me so you won't get lost. Wait, lost? What do you mean? C Craig? Craig? Just do it for Craig. Craig? Craig? Where did you go? Uh, I'll be back at the entrance since I can't find you. Wh what? Where's the entrance? Craig? Craig? Where are you? Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. Craig? Where are you?
Ah! Stay away from me! What? Craig, thank goodness you're here. There's someone, no, something chasing me. What are you talking about? Th that thing, over there! My mom? Th that's your mom? Yeah, and why are you being so rude to her? But she chased me first! She chased you because you were lost and she wanted to help. And don't think I noticed you were rude to everyone else. You ignored my entire family. You shook off my uncle's hand like it was contagious. And now you blame my mom for trying to help you? There is so much more I can list, but I won't even bother. I don't know what they have done to you to make you upset at them. Leave if you want to. I know you will anyway. Craig, wait, I'm... Craig, where are you? Craig? Hey, Craig. Um, I would like to say... Huh? Ah! Dude! What happened to your face? Nothing. I just took my makeup off. I thought you left. I never did. And I wanted to tell you that... I am sorry. I am sorry for my behavior and how I treated your family. It's just... I have never seen ghosts before, and I couldn't comprehend what was going on. You don't have to forgive me, but I don't want to lose you as my best friend. It's alright. I forgive you. Also, I'm sorry as well. I should have warned you about my family being ghosts. Oh, wait, Craig, we should play those cool new games. H Hello? That is a good idea. Let's all take a group picture. Uh, what is going on? We're taking a group picture. Everyone say cheese! Cheese! cheese. Hey, Craig! So glad you could make it! Come inside and follow me! We're gonna have a blast in this sleepover! Alright, Craig! This is my living room! Isn't it cool? I have almost every species of insect! Oh, my favorite one is here! Her name is Beth! Isn't she adorable? Huh. I think Craig has an extreme bug phobia. Oh well, let's get you a treat. You're such a nice centipede. Yes, you are. Yes, you are.
than for the good of society and especially for the good of the poor people who have fallen prey to this confusion. Transgenderism must be eradicated from public life. Legislation about transgender children and drag shows made a splash this week. 210. Thank you, Mr. Chair. We have to get in very tight. The number of in some states, you can't get to the So just last week, we are only about to get to the point of the story. We are only about to get to the point of the story. We are only about to get to the point of the story. Hey, hey.
Good morning, Timmy. Wake up, sweetheart. It's your first day of school. Are you ready to go? Alright, Noah, your shift's almost over. Why don't you just go ahead and clock out and I'll finish wrapping out, alright? Alright. Years I've been the truth from the public, and now 
There's no point in having two. You already won. What do you mean? Hey, Noah, how was your shift? It was fine. Just a normal one. Well, normal is good sometimes, isn't it? Yeah, I guess. Well, there's a new season of our show. I just made some dinner. Welcome, sit on the couch. I can't. I have a lot of work. Sorry. All right. Well, just don't forget to eat. Noah, you need to explain this, please. I thought I told you. But you told me you were gonna get back on track, all right? I don't consider you laying there on your phone getting back on track. Sweet pea, how'd you sleep? Slept all right. And you? I slept pretty well. Did you get that work done? Put your bagel. Dude, it smells like a dumpster. I know. <laughs> okay, well, I'll do two. Dude, do you get fed at home? Girl, I'm bulking for wrestling. Life is hard when you have holes. Okay, well, it's not gonna work if you have to crap it all out by next class. Anyways, me and Charlie are gonna go see that new Wreath and Shadow sequel after school next Friday. Do you wanna come with? I can't, I have work. Bro, work is always your excuse, man. And you hate that job anyways. Why don't you just quit? I'm sorry, maybe next time. Can I get a butter croissant? So it's four fifty, will that be all? Yeah. You gonna hand my stuff? Sorry. Yeah. Have a good one. Uh, 
Grandma died this morning at the hospital. And we tried to call, we tried to text, we tried to tell you we're going to the hospital, but you were just ignored. It's fine. Um, it's gonna be okay. Uh, I'm going to go get Dad from the airport. Come in. Hey, Ko. How are you doing today? We just got back and I wanted to check on you. All right, I can tell you don't want to talk, but just remember I'm only two doors down the hall when you're ready. I know we've talked about this to death, but I'll be driving you to school tomorrow. You're not using the bathroom. You know when the HDMI cable isn't plugged in? And the TV, it just sits there, waiting to be turned on. Absolutely Hi. not. Ow! I mean, I kinda get it. Like, you're feeling disconnected, sort of way. It feels like I'm watching my life pass me by. How can I be successful if I can't even get up in the morning? Noah, I get it. We get it. We all like to think that we've got life all figured out, when in reality, none of us ever actually do. But we can't focus on what we can't change. Noah, how about we just switch the showtime tickets to a time after your shift? That way we can all watch the movie together. It's on a Friday anyways. It's probably the smartest thing you've said. Hey, 
kiddo. How was your day? Yeah, it was fun. I saw a movie with Charlie and Eric. Um, we're both glad you're doing all right. We were going to have a movie night tonight, but we got distracted by those old VHS tapes. Do you remember them? Yeah, they're, they're cool to watch. I know things have been tough, especially after losing Nana, but you're stronger than you think. You can get through this and we can get through this, bud. Have a seat here. I want to hear about your day. Oh, 